All right, so today we're checking out an incredible AI tool that lets you create realistic and uncensored AI content. I'm talking stunning images and next level videos. And the best part is that it supports the Google Veo 3 model, all for just a fraction of the cost. And not just that, but it also supports the best AI video gen models out there. Even the number one ranked AI video gen from China called Cedits. I'm going to walk you through exactly how to use it step by step and even introduce you to a tool that can help you get the best possible prompt for an image or video. The tool can do a whole lot more, so stick around till the end because there is a small trick to using this tool that you don't want to miss. Now, if you want to get access to my special ebook with tips and tricks on how to make money with AI, just simply comment ebook and I will be sure to send it to you. Okay, so this is the name of the tool we're going to be using and it's called Nim Video. Don't worry, the link will be in the description. Now, what this tool can do is it can help you generate uncensored AI content with some of the best image and video gen models out there. Now, as you guys can see over here, it can help you generate a story, it can help you generate a video or an image. So first of all, let's generate an image. And for the image, let's put in a simple prompt. But for that prompt, what you need to do is to open a new tab. And to get the best possible prompt, just simply search for Generate Prompts AI. The link will also be in the description. Now you should be presented with this interface, and as you can see, it is the number one free AI prompt generator. And it's also free. I mean, with this tool, you basically don't need a prompt engineer. You can just use it and it'll help you generate the best possible prompts for your videos or images. Okay, so as you, as you can see, you can generate precise and professional level AI prompts for ChatGPT, Claude, Gemini, and more, a whole lot more, and it can enhance the output quality and boost your productivity. So if we slide down, we can see that it is an AI prompt generator. As you saw, it can also do prompt checking. It can also help you generate prompts for AI images. It can also help you generate prompts for AI video for VO3. And not just VO3, but it can help you generate prompts in general for videos, so that is really nice. Then over here is the AI text detector, so you can detect AI generated text, and this is the AI humanizer. That can allow you to humanize AI texts easily, so it can detect text and also humanize it. So that's nice. And as you can see over here, this is the image to prompt where you can convert images to AI prompts. And it also has an image to text where you can extract text from images. So that's very nice. So as you can see, if you want a simple image prompt, you can obviously drop it here, but let's go up here for the image prompts. So as you can see, all we need to do is put in a simple prompt like this. Then I click on Generate Image Prompt. Now, as you can see, in no time at all, it's giving us the prompt. So all we have to do is simply copy this and go back to this site and paste it in here. So we have this point over here. We could rewrite and could add different things and describe it. As you can see here, it has a lot of the best models. It has the Flux model, GPT image models, even Google Imaging 4 model, Quen, and a whole lot of high-end image gen models. So that's really cool. Then over here is simply the aspect ratio. We can select 16 by nine. And for the controls, as you can see, we leave this at Pro, and the image editing and consistency, we can just leave that blank. Then simply click on Generate. Now, as you can see, it's generating, then in no time at all, this is what it generated. And I mean, it looks really, really nice. It looks amazing, as you can see, this is like a cinematic level generation. So yeah, over here, we could send it straight to video, we could edit the image, use the lip sync, describe it, and do a whole lot more with this. So yeah, as you can see here, this is the resolution, which is really nice. Then we could go over here to download it and share it. So let's go back and use another prompt. So let's go back here, of course, and let's put in something like this for another prompt. Something like this for another prompt and click on generate image prompt. And as always, in literally no time at all, it's done. So we can copy this to the clipboard and then we could paste it in here and leave all these as is and click on generate. So once again, it's done. And it has created a very stunning image for us so we could download this. So yeah, that is really, really nice, really cool stuff. Then we could go back and we could also ask it for another prompt. Let's say something like this. I mean, as you guys can see, all the prompts I've put in here are really, really basic and simple. But when I click on generate, you can see that it has started generating and it converts this very short, very simple prompt into this whole long complex prompt. So this generate prompts AI literally negates the use of an AI prompt engineer. So we can go over here as always can paste it in here. Then there's also one thing about this tool that you need to know. This tool is completely NSFW. So if you go over to the settings section, you can see that in the preferences, you can either show NSFW contents or not. So obviously we'll leave it switched off because we're on this platform. I'm just showing you guys how it is. So let's go back. Then we can simply just generate this or let's change model and let's use GPT image and click on generate. So in no time at all, it's done. And this is what it cooked. And this looks hyper realistic. And it's just an amazing image in my opinion. So yeah, we can also go over here to download this. But then again, let's go and create a video with this tool. So for us to create a video, this can actually allow image to video too, where we could add an image or even character objects. So I'm sure you're wondering, can this generate prompt AI also generate for videos? And as you saw before, it can. So if you go over here, 
you can go to view three video prompts. Now this is view three video prompt, but you can describe a video for literally any video model out there. So all we need to do is to simply describe our video. So let's say something like this, a very simple prompt like this as always, and click on generate video prompts. Now again, in no time at all, it's done generating. So we could copy this, or we can see that this is the objective and this is the description. So what we need to copy is the description and we could literally just copy this and simply go back to this site and paste it. We didn't copy all those other ones because on here we could also select the aspect ratio. As you can see, it says aspect ratio here and all the other resolutions. So we already have all those presets here, but this is for VO3. And in VO3, you need to specify all these. So we could simply select our model. As always, we can use C-Dance, the best AI video gen model out there. Then for the controls, we leave all that as is. As you can see, it can go all the way to 10 seconds. Let's increase the resolution to 720p and click on generate. Now it's done generating and this is what it generated. We can enlarge this. And as you can see, this looks absolutely stunning. I mean, the tool did a great job. It's insanely realistic, but then again, it's C-Dance, one of the best AI video gen models out there. So we can go over here to download it. Over here, we could reuse the input. We could even upscale this, lip sync, clip editor, and a whole lot more as you can see here. So let's go back and generate the video for an actual person here. All we need to do is to put in a simple prompt like this, a simple prompt like this, and click on generate video prompts. Then as always, in no time at all it's done, and we copy the description, then go back on here and simply paste it. Then we could change the model to Juan, which is a completely uncensored model. Or let's use Google VO. Then we click on generate. But all the settings for the aspect ratio and every other thing were deselected because View 3 doesn't support all those things. So what we need to do is go back and copy the whole prompt, then paste it in here. And as you can see, it supports both VO3 and VO3 fast. So let's select the latest and greatest and click on generate. Okay, so in no time at all, it's done and this is what it generated. And as always, it looks completely stunning. It looks amazing. It's just really nice. I mean, look at the texture on the shirt. It looks really, really nice. So let's move on and generate another video. But this time, let's go back to C-Dance and let me adjust this prompt. And click on Generate Video Prompt. Okay, so that was nice. So we should copy the description. And then over here, we could paste it in. And as always, we use C-Dance. But this time, let's use the version in 1080p. And simply click on Generate. Okay, so it's done. And this is what it generated. And once again, it's done an amazing, amazing job. I mean, look at this. The quality is just top notch and it's really amazing. So we could upscale this. And as you can see, we could increase the resolution by four times and let's click on generate. Now, as we can see, the quality is way, way better, but that's nice. We can go over here to download this. One thing I love about this tool is its lip sync feature. So if we go over here and click on lip sync, we can see that this is our video. It also supports images, as you can see. So um, as you can see, this is target video and this is a video, so that's what we need. Then we could also select one of the voices. So let's listen to some of them. Hello, this is... Hello? Hello. Hello, this is an AI voice. I think Aria is best. So we could simply click on speech. Then we could simply type in the text we want to say. Something simple like this, and we can simply click on generate. Now, as you can see, it's done and we can see what it generated. Hey guys, what's up? Hey guys, what's up? So that was actually nice. And I mean, it's just entirely stunning. Be sure to check both the tools with the link in the description. And also like and subscribe for more AI content like this.